This game was originally found in an old hard drive that was bought from a garage sale. Upon checking the contents, some old game files of an old Courage game were found, and some, uh, some kind enough gentlemen have put this together, and this is that game. We're going to go play it today and see what it's all about. I tried hooking up a controller, but I uh, couldn't get some of the buttons working, so I'm going to use mouse and keyboard here, so hopefully it's not too janky. Um, this is sort of like a, yeah, an old PS1 Courage game, so we're going to check it out. Hopefully it's cool. See what's involved. Oh, okay, we can go in here. Monkey. There's the computer. Hello, computer. Oh, just some clicking noises. It does say this game is like unfinished, or some like data files are missing, so I'm not really sure what, what that's all about, but um, we'll see how far we get. If this doesn't get uploaded, then it doesn't get uploaded. Who knows? Oh, hold on, this is all strange. What's going on in here? Looks all evil. Oh, okay. It's a bit ominous. Very weird. I'm not sure what to expect with this. This is, um... You know, courage is... Oh my god, okay, that is terrifying. <laughs> Hello. What's this? Find them. That sounds really creepy find them. Who are them? Okay, I'll find them. This little mouse hole here is pretty sick. Heading out, heading out I guess. We've got two like stamina bar things here. I'm not sure if they're actually used or not. We'll find out later. Um, but this is pretty sick so far. It's pretty well done. I um, can't believe they didn't release it. Who am I finding here? Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, this is very weird, what's this, that's not working, okay, well I uh, guess we're off on an adventure, so yeah, this is, um, I found this looking online, this is like quite an old game actually, but um, oh, it was uploaded quite a while that is, and um, I thought, you know what, I'll have a look, see what it's all about. Um, all the comments I saw, like, most recently were, like, people confused, uh, about the game, like, they couldn't figure things out, so, I guess we'll, um, we'll go through and try and figure whatever we need to figure out. It shouldn't be that hard, it's only a, uh, yeah, an old PS1 game. These don't seem to be doing anything. Maybe we'll head down one of these paths. Very, very strange. Oh, dead end. Fun. If, uh, if you have any game suggestions, guys, please chuck them in the comments below. Oh, okay, another dead end. Chuck them in the comments below. I like uh, checking out a bit of everything. It doesn't matter what style of game, unless it's like a long-winded, horrible, you know, Silent Hill remake. Uh, let's not do that. I've played Silent Hill. It's good, but don't need to play any clones. <laughs> they go for a long time. I struggle to get through it. It's a good game, but yeah. Just, uh, not happening. What the hell am I supposed to do? This is weird. Oh, hold on. This one... This one doesn't... Oh, okay. There's a line here. So maybe if we follow this... Oh, and it's not making that noise. So what if we try this one now? And then this one? Maybe I figured this out already. Jeez, that was... It's the fastest I've ever solved a puzzle. Possibly. Now, it's not going through that chair there, so I'm going to leave it. And go up through this one. And this one again. I hope I'm getting this right. I really don't want to muck it up. Ooh. Okay, something happened. Well, let's go have a look. Maybe it's open like a secret door or something. It still looks empty. It's... Go down here and have a look. This is very, very weird. Doesn't... Like, this whole area, I guess, feels kind of like something from Courage, but... Yeah, I mean, that cartoon was very twisted, so... What were they thinking, releasing it to us? Still nothing down here. Hmm. Okay. Okay. 
This kind of reminds me of is like that old Rugrats game. It's like the way it's done. It just has that like art style and everything. There is nothing happening. Maybe I need to go back to the beginning. There was like another exclamation mark there as well. Let's go take a look. Birds? Why is there birds coming from this one spot? Weird. Anyways, let's head back to the beginning. Let's check out those uh, exclamation... Oh, sorry, question marks there. There was one, like, right in the middle. Or is it gone now? Oh, God, I'm never going to find it now, am I? Oh, there it is. Okay, that clicked. This is confusing. I have no idea what, what I'm doing. Oh, what the? No, 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 no. Oh my god, are you kidding? Shit. Okay, not really sure what happened there, but uh, we've worn back in and there's no furniture. I don't know what just happened. I accidentally... Oh god, that's, that's horrible. What the hell? What's going on? Maybe the computer has something to say. Oh my god, that sounds so bad. Oh, okay. This is very weird. It's my untimely end. Can I leave? Maybe? Good god. Is there something in there, maybe? It doesn't look like it. Maybe we need to use a different door. What did I lose? Is that what that means? I have absolutely no clue. Oh god, what the fuck? Uh, the game just crashed. Okay. I have no idea what is going on. Let's try that again. I think... So it just crashed again. I think it might have just been a dodgy, um... Dodgy loading? I don't know. Ah, here we go. It's fixed. I have no idea what happened there. That was so cooked. It was like it loaded some things, but not... I don't even know. Very weird, very weird. Anyways, uh, like the clock was in the middle. So are we... I think it's restarted us from the beginning here. Because we uh, we didn't get, get through properly. Yeah, okay. Okay. I'll have to skip back to where we were. Oh. Okay. No, I think I figured it out. So I think because I fell off the map... Maybe I died? I'm gonna explore that again. It looked like there was a platform there. I feel like, uh, I feel like this could be the way to go. There is birds here. But... It's not gonna appear again. I think I need to do this to open the... Open this sort of side area. So we're gonna try this again. Okay, let's see how that goes. Hopefully that fixed it. It's, um, it's been a bit of time. I've been doing a lot of mucking around trying to get through this. Oh, here we go. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. We're in. Okay, this is very wacky. Good thing the platform's big enough. Oh, okay, we got another question mark. Interesting. So now do I go back? Maybe there's something else for us to do. Maybe now we can go back to the beginning. It's uh, super strange. The worst bit is like, it's so ambiguous that you could spend like, if, if I wasn't so lucky with figuring out that middle section, I would have been here for ages, I feel like. 
because that, that wall doesn't open up, doesn't give you any indication of what's going on at all. Something, no, nothing down there, unless there's another invisible wall, but check down these paths first. This looks a bit longer. Oh, hello, what's this? In memoriam of Muriel. Oh, it's doing that thing again. Oh, no. Okay, game crashed again. Uh, so I looked it up. That was actually a memorial for the actress that played Muriel, um, which is interesting. Not really sure why it crashed again, but we're going to try and load the game again and see if... Um, hopefully it doesn't boot us back to the beginning. Dog. Oh, dear God. What the hell? Okay, funky. Oh, okay. I've uh, fallen off. Please don't take me to the beginning. Oh, it's crashed the game again. The hell? So after much mucking around, I had to look online and um, there was a bit of a guide on this one because I could not figure it out for the life of me. Tends to have to uh, install like a shader software to see where I'm going because nothing is lit up and the path is quite insane. Now, my screen's going to be a bit weird here when I do this, but I believe it was the display depth. Now, for some reason, I can't get this on my entire screen, but um, I need to follow these paths, which are actually pitch black. So, I'm actually just going to cut this near the end, because I don't know why it's going uh, like half the screen here in the recording, but um, yeah, we're going to pick a route, and then we're going to head that way. Interestingly enough, um, as well, looking at this uh, sort of guide for this like level, I realized that there's this noise in the background, it's kind of like a high pitch beam noise. It turns out it's actually the layout of the map played in like an audio file. So someone, to figure this out, uh, put the entire sort of recording into an audio program and, and, you know, did some mucking around and was able to actually get the layout of the level. And that's when they realized that they needed some shading software to uh, to get through this because no one, you know, it would take an insane amount of time. Many, many. I couldn't imagine how much time it would take to figure this out without um, this sort of assistance. You wouldn't be able to get through this with it being completely pitch black. It's just an absolute nightmare, especially with all the uh, separate trails leading off into nowhere. It would be a nightmare. Oh, thank God, we're so close. This has been... This has taken so long. It's actually insane. Finally. Please tell me I can get out of here. Oh, we're crashing again. And we have crashed. Oh my God, it's turned into Sonic. This is... Incredible. This is my favourite part of the game so far. Oh. Time is... Oh, I don't know, stuff is slowing down. This is very weird. Oh. How am I supposed to get up here? Oh, we were so close. Okay, weird. Ah, there we go. I've got some, uh, you know, gravity boots. This is fantastic. we got Muriel's player too, that's a bit scary. I don't know where she is. Okay, let's get the rest of these coins. The music has stopped. Oh! Data missing? What do you mean, data missing? Okay, after doing a bit of digging on these data missing screens, which are actually meant to happen, um, in hidden, I had to change some of the uh, brightness settings with this, uh, with this tool. You see on the top left it says it was her, and then on the right it says, like, Leonor, Leonor, something like that, uh, which I need to look into. Um, so now I'm going to have to figure out what to do next, because I'm completely confused. So it appears that there is three data missing screens that we've sort of got to get to, and that was the first one. 
So now we're going to do the second one. So I think we've started from the, the beginning here again. So we're going to go through and do that thing. I think this next one is based off where we were in that sort of area where everything was, um, yeah, completely dark. And we had to adjust the shader settings. Instead of turning left and going to that chair throughout the long path, we're going to go for the shorter path and see what happens uh, in that direction. And then for the last screen, I'm not really sure. Um, like, I've just been, as I've been playing, I've sort of been doing research, which is seems like a terrible idea now. But um, I'm starting to understand what this is all about. So, we're going to do our chair thing again. And, uh, open up the uh, secret wall and I uh, might skip us ahead to where we need to be maybe maybe I might not I might make you guys just suffer through it we'll see just a quick note on this as well uh, once you reboot the game after getting these uh, data missing screens um, if you reboot the game it's gonna keep going to this screen so you need to go into uh, the files where the saved games files are and you need to delete them and it will sort of reload you back into the game from the beginning. Uh, this this has to be done, otherwise you'll be stuck. Okay, so we're going to go to the right path this time. It actually still is quite a long way. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm sure there is a fix for this half screen issue, but I, look, I just think uh, at my wit's end when I first sort of got this set up. I was losing my mind trying to figure this out. I thought, you know what? As long as I can see at all, I'm happy. It's really, really triggering that I can't just walk straight. Like, I think I'm constantly constantly moving left or right. I'm not actually going straight, which is really upsetting, because if you look at this path on the right here, it's very slowly coming towards me. Very slowly, so I'm going to turn left and just try and straighten up. This might be straight, but it might be slightly to the left, who knows. At least we'll get to the end here. Okay, so finally at the end of this path, it kind of looks like a doorway, or is it like a ramp up? Oh, here we go. Oh dear. Okay, weird. I think we'll turn off this setting. No, let's leave it back on. It gets more and more bizarre. Till we head into the house at least. Um not really sure where. Is this Courage's house? It doesn't look like it. It's supposed to be like a farmhouse. Maybe when I pass through here. Can I now turn it off? Ah, oh, here we go. Oh god, this looks terrifying. Uh, can't go in. Oh dear, okay. Is this Eustace? Robert W. Oh dear god. What's happening again? Bomb. Oh, we're back. Okay. The house is looking a lot different. Very dark. Oh dear god, that is terrifying. <laughs> is this supposed to be Eustace? Please don't hurt me. Oh my god. Another data missing. Okay, let's adjust this and have a look at what it says. Deweezer something was there to greet me. Mr. Wheeler was there to greet me, I think? That's what it says? I don't know, it's not making sense to me either. So we're back this time, we're trying to find the third of hopefully just three uh, missing game file screens. It looks like it has to do with where I was at the very beginning when I went into that area with the sort of grandfather clock. So I've got to do, I guess, the steps that I did where I sort of just fell off the platform. And I'm hoping that takes me to where I need to go. I'm going to kind of do it the exact same way because I don't want to muck this up in any way. So we come through here, oh, falling off, and game crashes now. Okay, so we're back, we're in this area again, um, and 
Obviously the clock isn't in the middle yet, so I think we went upstairs. We mucked around with some of the doors. Not sure if this one let us in. Okay, yep. Super weird. Aha! This was the third one. I can't believe I missed this. Father wasn't home. I think that's the third one. Well, there you have it, everyone. I think that's it. Uh, from what I can see online, and through all the threads I was reading, uh, those are the three missing save files, at least, uh, that we were to find. It was a very, very stressful game. Um, it, I, You'd have to be, like... The amount of time it would have taken to like put these puzzles together and whatnot. Insane. Um, yeah, respect to uh, that whole side of things. I wouldn't have been able to figure it out without uh, the help of many peoples on the internet. So, luckily, uh, that was a factor. But if you like this playthrough, guys, consider subscribing. Hit like if you don't mind. And... Uh, I might see you again soon. Again, if you have anything for me to play, put it in the comments. I'll have a read and I might just play it. Farewell until next time.